As usual, no one cares. All alone, I will eat my cake and drink my drink. Mommy. Hello, baby girl. How are you? Mommy, I'm fine. And you? <laughs> Just bubbling. Um, where are you? Mommy, I'm in the apartment. I'm about leaving though. I have early morning lecture. Oh, that's great. Um, what of your sister Sonia? Is she there? Uh, um, mommy, no, she is not. I've been trying to get a hold of her since last night and her phone has been switched off. Really? Um, uh, she, she, she had left earlier. Did she leave her phone in the house? No, mom. Obviously, she went with her phone. But I trust that her battery is down because, mommy, you know now, you know the epileptic power supply we have here. I really want to talk to her. Okay, not to worry. Immediately, I'll try and reach her and then I'll tell her to call you back immediately. Okay, that's fine. Please, make sure she calls me as soon as you see her, okay? I will not fail to do so, mommy. Take care of yourself, okay? I'm already late for lecture. Alright. Have a lovely day, my darling. Bye. Love you, mommy. Love you. Bye. number no connecting this girl wants to put me in trouble eh? she just made me lie to her mom now where could she be where is she is she not supposed to be back by now i don't know i'll just keep trying because i'm already late i'm already late The same spot. Why is her number Do not connect. I've been waiting for how long now? I'm by my car, just on the same road that you, yeah, where we, we came the other day. Yes, I. I'm not connecting for Okay. 
I'm still here, the same place, the same road. Ooh, hey, bro, I'll call you back. Hello, pretty lady. How are you? Hi, stranger. Good morning. Look at the weather, and I think it's an offense to have you walk in this weather today. Let me have the honor of being your driver for the day. Excuse you. Is it not rather too early in the day for all this drama? Please. I am not ready for any of this, okay? And I do not even know you from anywhere. And no, but please, 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 I, I am not rain. interested. Just let me. Hello, mommy. Yes, yeah, is she back? Mom, I've not seen her. I've looked everywhere for her. I've not seen her. And nobody even knows her whereabouts yet. <sighs> Hurry. I don't like the way I'm feeling. I. Oh, wait. When did you say she left the house? Annabelle, are you there? Is that something you're not telling me? No, no, Mom. I, I just haven't seen her yet, but I am very sure. I'm being optimistic that I will see her. I just want to go ask a few persons if they know anything about her whereabouts. Okay. I'm waiting. All right, Mom. I'll, I'll call you as soon as I hear anything. Thank you, Mom. Bye. What part of leave me alone don't you understand? From your phone call, is there a problem at all? I could be of help. Perhaps drop you off wherever you're going very quickly. I do not want you to drop me off. Just leave me alone. Are you deaf? I said I do not want you to drop me off. It takes a minute to get to know someone and I'm thinking you probably think you don't know me, that's why. Okay, you have nothing to lose. All I want to do is to drop you off. It might rain and you don't want to get drenched wherever you're going. Let me just drop you off. Just a drop off, nothing else. A drop off. Just a drop off. A drop off. You won't ask me for my number. No. You won't ask my name. No names. Just a drop off. Just a drop off. And that's it. And that's it. Whatever you want, it's my wish. I will just drop you off to wherever you're going. Can I just take you to my car and I'll drop you off? not funny anymore. It's not funny at all. It is very obvious that something is not right here. I mean, I've not been able to get a hold of Sonia since last night. Now, Annabelle is clearly avoiding my call. <laughs> oh, no. No, 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 no. I won't stay here until things get worse. I need to do something.
Hi, bro. You're back. Yes. What's up? How was the day? Good. Bye. What are you working on? I'm working on this new design for my girl's new gig. Another free job? My yo, don't expect me to collect money from my girl. I do this for love, you know. What has love got to do with anything? What has love got to do with earning a living on a daily? I will get a good job soon. And while you're waiting for that dream job, right? Use this knowledge you have about graphic design to earn a living instead of doing these free gigs for whoever you call her. Mayo. Yes. This is not today. I am not in for your salmon. Let's talk about you. How was your day? <laughs> you do make me laugh. Trying to change the subject. Yeah. However, anyway, I had an amazing day. I'm going to tell you all about it. Okay. I met this beautiful girl. I see exactly what I'm talking about. No, you see? The port's calling the kettle black. Your level of womanizing is divine. Okay, can I ask you a question? Go ahead. When was the last time you were in a serious relationship? No, tell me. All you do is hit and run. <laughs> Listen. Love isn't for everyone. Oh. Someone like yourself, you like to take a seat mm. at the love table and remain there. Yeah. Someone like me, I want to have fun and move. Oh. Okay, but as I was saying before your unsolicited interjection, if you see this girl, oh my, oh my. Did you get her number? You're not going to believe this. Tell me. Unfortunately not. She refused to give me her number, nor her name. <laughs> this is hard to believe. The almighty Muiwa, 21st century woman charmer. You met a girl and you couldn't get her number nor her name. Bro, it's hard to believe. I'm going bro, back to work. Bro, bro, you will not understand. She vehemently refused, like as in categorically no. But not to worry. I know her face and I'm going to smoke her out very soon. Really? Can I join you? Join me. <laughs> hey, well, you make me laugh. You make me laugh. No, you Stop make me laugh. I am Fregis. not the womanizer here. And you are doing Fergus and earning no money. Okay, I see because <laughs> I stay in your house. <laughs> Don't even say that. Mommy. You're welcome. Annabelle, huh? why have you not been taking my calls? And where is your sister? Mommy, sit down first. Mm. Now. What are you not telling me? Mm -hmm. Honestly, I do not know where Sonia is. Though. She left the house since yesterday to see a friend. She's not uh, bad. Uh, okay, okay. Which friend? Who is the friend? What's her name? Where does she live? Who is the person? I, do, I don't know the person, no. She met the person on the internet. The internet? My God! What are you telling me? Annabelle, what are you telling me? That your sister left this house to go see a total stranger and you never bothered to get the person's details? What are you saying? Sorry, I should you have... should be sorry for yourself! Sorry for yourself! Oh God! What is she saying? How? How can you allow your kid sister to be wandering around this town in the enclave of a stranger? What kind of a big sister are you? Are you not supposed to be looking out for her? Mommy, it's not my fault. Oh, it's not my fault. Uh, 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 Sonia does not listen to me. Eh, and I've been calling all our friends. Nobody I've seen her yet. It's not my fault now. So you just don't listen to me. <sighs> A stranger. Hey! Seriously, Mayowa. I think you're being too careless and reckless at the same time. Come on, bro. 
I'm only but a very young man who just want to have fun and flex. That's all, nothing more to it. And live your life to the fullest, I guess. Yes. By sleeping and dumping girls like rags? Come on, that's not fair. Okay, let me ask you. The last one you brought home the last time, I can't remember her name. The pretty one. Where's she? I don't know. And I don't care. Oh, I got what I wanted and that's it for me. Oh God. But I thought she was the one for keeps. <laughs> you really do make me laugh. Listen, I am not cut out for love. I'm not cut out for relationships. All I want to do, as I told you earlier, have fun, have sex, flex, and move on. After all, I give them good sum of money at the end of it all. So, I mean, is that not what they all want? No, your problem. I think you have a very bad notion about women. I can't believe we are friends. How did we make it again? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, you are way too boring for my liking. Really? Really. But I'm still going to be managing you like that. Not like you have a choice. <laughs> I do have a choice. <laughs> you don't. No, you don't. <laughs> Biggie, Biggie, how are you? How's school? School is fine. Just the usual stress. Okay. How are you? I'm fine. What's up? You didn't go to work today. I did. I just got back about like 30 minutes ago. But is today your lecture free day? No, but I'm so exhausted. I just needed to lay my head. No. I can swear that I noticed you in this house yesterday. No, not at all. How can you say you saw him here yesterday? You see him now and what I you... know what I'm talking about. Listen, I saw a lecture handout in my room, my bedroom. Okay? And before I left for work yesterday, it wasn't there. I think I left the last time I came around. Yes, I left something like that. Okay. Well, so how are you? Bro, I'm fine. I'm just hanging in there. I am so tired of school. Hey, come on. How can you say that? You need education. But education is no longer making sense to me. Well, was in the kitchen. I'm starving. Nothing. 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 Did you employ a, um, a cook here? Well, I'll go fix myself something to eat. Good. But in the meantime, we do it this. Put that one down. Go. Bring it. Go get your own. That's mean. No, don't treat him Make like for that. Three. Don't treat <laughs> him like mean. that. He's not being mean. He just got back from school. Come on, what does he do? Only go to school. We work on. Well, I work. You don't work. You're terrible. I am so disappointed in you. So disappointed. So tell me, what do we do? Where on earth do we begin to look for her? Where? I don't know. I'm as confused as you are. I think we should just go to the police station. I mean, it's been almost 24 hours since it's missing, so let's go and report. We can't go to the police station. We don't know if she's missing or not. We just can't assume that she's missing. Maybe she, she turned her phone off on purpose. Who knows? That is not possible. Sonia can never do that because of a stranger. Never. Hello? Yes, it's me. What did you just say? <laughs> no. No, 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 no. You, I'm very sure you're joking. Yes, you can't be serious. Okay. Okay. Sorry. 
What is it? Who called you? Mom, what is it now? Talk to me. Who called you? And what did the person say? Say something now. This, this silence is deafening. What did the person say? And why did the person call you? Mommy, what is it? Mommy, wait for me. Investigation is going on and we're not relenting. And I want to show you that the killers of your daughter must be found out and made to face the law. This is really heartbreaking. My own sister was murdered by some faceless monsters and her lifeless body dumped on the roadside. I want to go over the statements you made before. You said your sister left the house in the evening of Thursday to see someone she met on the internet. Yes, that's exactly what she told me. And she never mentioned the name of this internet stranger. No. She never did. When exactly was the last time you spoke to your sister? That was the last conversation we had. She was supposed to come back the next morning, but she never showed up. <laughs> Officer. My daughter murdered in this town and the killer is somewhere roaming free please clip this pain in my soul find that killer or killers and make them pay for what they did to me. Please. Okay, madam. I want to reassure you that no stone will be left unturned in this matter. Okay? <sighs> we will do everything humanly possible to fish out the killer or killers of your daughter. Alright? And they will pay. For what they did. <sighs> this place will don't take murder lightly. Not at all.
Hey, Kayo, hey, hey. Kayo, what is Are it? Are you okay? You must have had a horrifying dream. Kayo, talk to me. Are you okay? I'm fine. I'm fine. Come on, bro. Listen, speak to me. What is wrong? Not really. I'm good. Fine. Well, if he says he's fine, then so be it. Bro, we need to bounce. It's Saturday. We need to secure a good spot. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm fine. All right, if you say so, I will see you when we return, okay? Wait, wait. Let me come with you guys. I can't possibly stay alone in this house. <laughs> Hold on. Are you scared? Whatever you saw in that dream must be very horrifying. Okay, listen. Go get ready and let's go, but don't be late, okay? Please okay. don't be long, okay? Wow. Whoa. I wonder what he must have encountered in that dream. Whoa. I've never seen him that scared. I don't know. I mean, oh. no. And he's actually so scared he wants to go with us. Let him come with us then. That's incredible. How? <sighs> How could my daughter trust a total stranger? How? I still do not understand it. This is killing me. This is killing me. <laughs> oh. <sighs> Somebody, please wake me up from this bad dream. Please wake me up. <gasps> My sister cannot just go like that. Just like that. <sighs> My daughter was murdered. Slaughtered like, like a fowl. And then dumped by the roadside like she's nothing. God, why are human beings so wicked? God. Why, why are they heartless? Oh God, what have we done to deserve this? What did we do? Hey, God, this is too much. This is too much for us to bear. This is too much for us to bear. This wasn't what life promised us at all. Hey! God, please. <laughs> God, this guy is just too funny. So this is all you do, sit here, chat, and laugh out loud like you're a mad woman. See, I'm having a very interesting convo here. I beg you, you won't understand, Sha. Mm. Sonia. <laughs> Sonia. What? This is not why you're here. Honestly, you're, you're getting too distracted by this internet thing. You're getting too distracted. You need to let go of this noise and focus on your studies. Sis, don't be a cute joy now. Eh? I'm having fun here, please. I beg you. Just leave me alone. You're having fun. I'm having fun. I know that is what you would say. But look at it, Sonia. No, look at it very well. You are just in your second year. Second year, oh, and your results are looking bad already. Stop. My results are not bad. Okay, my results are not bad. And what is it now? Look, I don't have strength to listen to your preaching this evening. I'm here in the university to read and to have fun too. I, I can't come and kill myself now. What is it? Ah, no one is saying you shouldn't have fun. But you need to focus on the main reason you're here in the first place, which is to study. Yes. 
Since you know what? It's enough. You can have the entire room to yourself. <laughs> he just said to me, I'm not that perfect. <laughs> Sonia, what is wrong with you? Why are you, why are you like this? Why are you like this? You're always, you're full of yourself. You think you know it all. You never take corrections and you don't listen to anybody. What is wrong with you? I'm here trying to tell you to, to focus on your studies and you're working out on me. You're still chatting. So that I'm talking to you, don't work out on me. What is wrong with you, this girl? Eh? For what? I don't know. Anywhere. I just need space to get my He won't leave too. Your sister is gone. Do you want to leave also? I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't stay here. the problem? I mean, what is happening? You have been like this all day. What's the matter? No, I'm fine. I'm okay. Do not give me that crap. You are not fine. You are very, very far from being fine. No, you are, please. Do not bother about me. If there's an issue, I will let you know. But as for now, I am fine. No, you are not fine. There's an issue and you are going to let me know that issue right here and now. Okay? I mean, how do you expect me to be comfortable knowing that you are bothered about something and there's nothing that I can do about it? Kayade, look at me. Bro, believe me when I say I'm fine. Trust me. I am not a kid, you know. I'm your elder brother. Not the other way around. So don't you think for a second that you can fob me off. I mean, are you in the serious debt or something? Are you in danger? Are you in a serious issue? Or perhaps you've impregnated no, you someone please. that... Please! Do not push this. Well, if you wouldn't mind, at this point, I want to be left alone. Please. I can't just... Leave me alone, please. Please, just leave me alone. Please. Seeking me. <gasps> incorrect password again. Eh? Incorrect password again. How do I even know the real password? If I can get her password, at least I'll get a clue from there.
What kind of problem is this now? What kind of problem is this? How do I even know her password now? Eh? Thank you. <laughs> she like you, right? Okay, I'll talk to you later. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> hey. I'll talk to you later. Annabelle, welcome. Thank you. How was your day? Oh, tiring, but great. Lectures was great. And you, sitting, chatting, and laughing out loud, as usual. <laughs> no lectures today. I had one earlier in the day. Why are you overly excited? What's the gist? <laughs> Sis, you can't believe it. I met with this very cute bubble on Instagram. This guy is loaded. Oh, just shut up, Sonia. Shut up. Are you going crazy or what? No, is this why mom is paying heavily for you to be in this university? Why do you spend days on the internet suffering for men to run after? Um, um, please, 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 Annabelle, hold it. Look, 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 I'm, I'm tired of this, your righteous act. What is it now? It is my life. Let me live it the way I want. Really? Yes. And shamelessly selling your body to different men is what pleases you, right? What do you even gain sleeping with different men at this your age? So that don't you have shame? Yes, I do not have shame. It's my life. I'm an adult, so I would live my life the way it pleases me. Uh -uh. You're poking now. You're poking too much. Let me be. Okay, okay. I'm sorry I even raised my voice. Okay? So now listen. I am your sister. And I am the only one who will tell you when you're wrong. What you're doing is not right. It is bad. Remember where we're coming from. And we are not supposed to do anything to tarnish the good name and image that we have. Come to think of it, Sonia, what is it that you lack that mommy does not give to us? Just take a look at this apartment. Which of your classmates in your class can afford this apartment? How many? Still, you are not satisfied. You run after different men from different places, Instagram, WhatsApp. What is it? Anibal, what is it? Please, what exactly do you want? Let me ask you, what exactly do you want from me? Why do you keep poking your claws on my face? Allow me live my life. Let me be, Annabelle. Let me be. You're choking me. Please. Hmm. Sonia. A word they say is enough for the wise. It is not late for you to make amends. It is not late for you to retrace your steps. That's all I have to say to you. Madam Wise, it is my life and I am not interested what you or anyone has to say. Let me leave it the way I want it. Ah, oh, please. It's a... Let me go back to what I was doing before she rudely interrupted. Bobo, fine. Hey! Loaded. <laughs> I'm so, 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 so lucky. Ha! See picture. <laughs> if only Sonia listened. If only she listened to the voice of reasoning. Eh? If only she stopped to think and amend her ways. No, she never wanted anyone in her business. She never wanted us to interfere. 
She didn't want anyone to interfere. Now see. All Sonia was after was material things. She was never satisfied with anything. She was never satisfied with anything that she had. Good. Hi, yeah, sis. Hi. I'm going out. <sighs> Where are you going to? Look, I'm going to see one bubble like that. <sighs> Sonia, are you not scared? With all the things happening in this town, ritual killings, Kidnapping. You still dress up. So tell me that you're going to see someone you met on the internet. What do you know about the person? What are you trying to say? What are you trying to say? Sonia, what is wrong with you? Why don't you like listening to me? Why don't you listen to anybody? Why will you not just focus on the main reason you came to the school in the first place? Do you know the problem I have with you, sister? You're so uptight and you want everybody to live your kind of lifestyle. Hell no! I will never be dragged into your darkness. Please, I will never. What now? Allow me, I love lights. Hmm? Really? Yes. <sighs> Sonia, I am your sister. And I will never, I will never stop telling you the truth. Whether you like it or not, I will tell it to your face. Can I go now? Yes. And please, let me remind you, I don't want to take part in your unsolicited teachings. I am an adult. I can live and run my affairs, okay? As a matter of fact, I'm doing that pretty well. So please, Sister, pack off. Pack off. I'm running late for my appointments. Bye. Sis! Hey, sis! I'm back, sis. I am back in one piece. Sister, nobody chopped off my head. Nobody kidnapped me. As a matter of fact, <laughs> I came with lots of money in my account. Hey! I'm super excited. I mean... You know, there's, there's a popular saying that the road to hell is paved with good intentions. And that is the road that you're walking on. Annabelle, don't be a killjoy. You should be excited for your sister. I mean, I have money. The bubble I went to see. Hey! This guy oh, is... Just shut, shut up, Sonia. Shut up. What do you lack? What is it you want that mommy does not provide for us? Our mother is equally rich. You know that, right? I know that, but I want my own money. My own money, not mommy's money now. You know that you're gradually turning into a prostitute and a very irritating one at that. How dare you call me a prostitute, Annabelle? How dare you? Are you not one? Hmm? No, tell me what I have said now that isn't the truth. What you are doing and what they do. Tell me the difference. Do you know what, Annabelle? I will not stand here and allow you rain insult on me, okay? Stop it. Stay on your lane and clear off mine. Clear off mine, Annabelle. You will get accidents. Clear off my lane. Rubbish. You can never be excited for your sister. My sister is gradually walking into her own doom and destruction. My sister. 
sister cannot die even. My sister cannot die in vain. She was stubborn. She was foolish. She did all sort of things, but that is not enough reason for her to die. No one had the right to cut her life short. Why? I need answers. Why? What have I done? Why did you take my Sonia from me? Why? This is really too much. This is too much. Sonia was a lovely soul. She was a lovely girl. And she didn't deserve to die like that. Listen, the university is a different world altogether. A whole new world. And in that different world, a lot of things happen. Yes, Mom. But I'm glad I'm going to that world. I can't wait to have that experience, Mom. I'm also glad you're going. <laughs> <laughs> I am glad too. Thank you, Mom. Just that I want you to know that in that different world, people get lost easily. And it is also very easy for them to forget the real reason they are there in the first place. Mom, you know I'm very happy that you're telling her all of this. Because she's just overly excited about going to the university. I don't <laughs> know why. Of course she should be. Oh, I mean, you. it's not easy. I just want her to understand that the university is a whole new, different world. Yeah, yeah, true. Don't worry yourself, okay? I'll make you proud there. Mom, you know I'm a good girl, right? <laughs> and see, I promise you, I will graduate with good grades, Mom. I promise. Mm -hmm. That is what I want from you. Thank you, Mom. That is my girl talking. <laughs> Thank and you. trust me, I am not scared that you're going. Not at all. After all, your sister is there already. And I'm sure she will take good care of you. Of course, Mom. I will take care of her. But she has to promise not to be stubborn. <laughs> <laughs> Very stubborn. No, 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 see, I don't like the way you're making me feel like I'm a baby. I'm a big girl. I'm a big girl. <laughs> eh? Yes, I am. You're the baby in this house. You no. are my baby. <laughs> I know. And you will always, in fact, forever <laughs> be my baby. Hmm? Mommy, thank you so much. Just make me proud. I will, I promise. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> oh, with you, Lord. Congratulations. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you, sis. Thank you. Investing girl. Oh, I'm the girl. <laughs> I blame you, Annabelle. I blame you for this. You never took care of your kid sister. I left her in your care. But you abandoned her. You abandoned her to her ways. You allowed her to behave the way she wanted. Now she is dead. Left by the roadside like trash. It is all your fault. Sonia, I promise you. I promise you I will find your killer or killers. No matter how long it takes. I will avenge your death.
Annabelle, why? Annabelle, why? Why did you do this to me? Annabelle, why? Why? No phone was recovered from the crime scene. What of an ATM card? Because I gave her my card the day she left the house. We did not find any item on her body, nor the crime scene. Sir, please, I beg you. Do anything, anything you can to help us. The killer or killers of my only sister should not be allowed roaming the streets freely. Please help us. See, my men are doing everything humanly possible to fish out the perpetrators of this act and make sure that they are brought to justice. Okay? Is there anything you want from us? Anything that will help with the investigation so that it can be faster? We have everything <laughs> we need from you. We've already applied for her call law to be forensically <laughs> examined. We're just waiting for the judge to sign off on it and the network providers will provide us with the call log and we're good to go. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> you need to get a hold of yourself. Why is okay. this happening to us? Why is this happening to us? Trust me, we're not going to rest. We are going to rest until this is done. I can assure you, we will fish out these people and make sure they pay for what they did. Please. This is your fault. It is all your fault. It's your fault that she died. I mean, she died because of you. Mom, I am not to be blamed. Why are you laying everything on me? Why? I left her with you. I left her in your care. But you abandoned her. You did not take care of her. You allowed her to roam around. You allowed her to do what she pleased. Now she is dead. Mommy, this so whose fault is it? Mommy, this is not fair. This is not fair. God knows I... I took care of Sonia. I loved her. I advised her. I tried my best for Sonia. I did everything a big sister would do. I did everything, mother. You did nothing. Nothing at all. <laughs> because if you did, She'll be here with us. This is not my fault. This is not my fault. I want her. I want her, mommy. I want her. You need to talk to Sonia. You need to make her understand the importance of being serious with her studies. Mom, don't listen to her. I am serious about my studies. Of course you know you are not. And stop lying. You're just too distracted with the internet every time you're on social media. And you know that is affecting your studies. Mom, don't mind her. She's simply trying to make me become an introvert like her. Look, I understand the fact that you don't like to socialize. But hey, I'm not like you and I will never be. And that is the truth. Mm. <laughs> Annabelle, 
you know your sister is wired differently and oh. she can't be as conservative as you are. Mommy, you're missing the point here. This girl is no longer the Sonia you used to know. She has changed completely. She has become wild. Mom, Can't you see? Mom is a lie. She's high-handed and she treats me as though I'm a kid. Um, listen. I know you love your sister. And you're just looking out for her. But I think you should tone it down. I mean, take it easy on her and then treat her gently. Okay? Okay? It's, it's okay. Anything you say goes. But I know exactly what I'm saying. Mommy said, tone it down. Uh, tone it down. <sighs> but mommy, it's fashion, you know. <gasps> I told you. I warned you about Sonia's reset bad behaviors. I thought you she wasn't taking her studies serious, but what did you do, mother? You sided out always. Now you turn around to blame me. <gasps> you turn around to blame me, mother. This is not fair. I miss my baby. <laughs> I miss my baby so much. I want her here with me. I want her here with me. I really miss her. I miss my <laughs> I miss her too. She was my only sister. I miss her. This is hard for me as well. I wish she listened. I wish she listened to me. First off, I want to study law mm -hmm. and then I'll go on to become the best female lawyer in this country. I trust you. And then, <laughs> when we just wait, I'll go on to marry a man who will become the president of this country. Hmm. Yes, and then I will become the first lady. Oh, wow. That's a big <laughs> dream. Thank you, Mom. <laughs> but very achievable yeah you know you can achieve anything anything you set your heart on i hope you know that yes of course mom hey mom when i finally become the first lady mm. that automatically makes you who the mother of a first lady <laughs> and then the in-law of a president <laughs> <laughs> i can picture it and that is so sweet thank you mom but why don't you have it the other way around? I mean, instead of you aspiring to be the first lady, why don't you aspire to be the president? President, Mom? Mm -hmm. But no female has ever become a president in this country. So you will go ahead to become the first female president of this great nation. How about that? Wow! Mommy, this is so sweet. Mommy, you are making sense. <laughs> Did you know, I've never ever thought of it that way. I know. Whoa. So I could become the first female president of this country. Mm -hmm. Wow. And then, Mommy, do you know how they will address me? Um, Excellency, Ma. <laughs> um, no, 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 no. Um, um, Madam President, Ma. <laughs> that's more like um, it. No, no, that's not it, Mommy. Um, um, yeah, that's it, right? Yeah. Madam President, Ma. Yeah. That is it. <laughs> and then, Mommy, I'll be walking with shoulders high, you know. Hmm. Um, I can't wait. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy, so sweet. I feel good already. Hello. My baby had dreams. She had plans for her life. So why did this happen to me? Why? Why did this happen? What did I do? I don't know, Mom. I do not have answers to your questions. 
But I want to assure you that I will get to the root of this matter. I will find Sonia's killers and make them pay. <laughs> What more can we do? The police has been on this case uh, up till now. No headway. I don't know. I have no idea. But I promise you, Mother, with or without the help of the police, I will find her killers and make them suffer. Even if it means me dying, but I will find them. <laughs> Say that again, Annabelle. Do you hear me? Don't you dare say that again. Don't mention death again. Do you hear me? Again. killed and her body dumped by the roadside and up till now we do not even know who did it oh, that's to say the least horrifying how callous can the heart of man be i mean what sort of a demon would possess a man to take the life of another we have been going back and forth with the police investigation is leading nowhere. My mother is devastated. I am so sorry for the loss. You know, just take heart and I believe that the perpetrators will be apprehended and justice served appropriately. I hope so. I just hope so because I am losing my mind. I am losing my mind and my mother is losing her mind too. Sorry. This world is indeed a mysterious place. Just take her to my cry. Okay? Let me... Oh, no, come here. Come here. Do not cry. Do not cry. The investigation will be fine. Okay? The perpetrators will be apprehended. Yeah. I hope so. Yeah. Take her. I just hope so. Take her. Hi, bro. Hey. Welcome. Good. What's up? I'm good. What are you up to? I'm Some good. freeness for your girl again, I think. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> what? I thought you had an interview today. What happened? Ah, uh, the company called and cancelled up for me. So, they were scheduled for next week. So, I've been home all day. What? Okay. Well, at least um, it's been rescheduled. Mm. Guess what? What? It happened today. Sorry, what happened? I've got the name and I've got the number. <laughs> what exactly are you talking about? Can we skip to the part where you tell me exactly whose name and number we're talking about? Oh, are you such a dunce debate? God, the same girl that I told you last week who vehemently refused to give me her details. How would I remember? Damn, you have them in numbers. So do not hang me for not skipping tabs of all your escapades. Whatever. By the way, I saw her again today. I got her name, I got her number, and I even got more. 
<laughs> what is funny? What are you talking about? I said I saw the girl that I told you about. The one that said she wasn't going to give me her number. I remember I came home telling you that she refused to give me her number. Okay. Yes, yeah, so I saw her. Okay. And I got her name, I got her number, and I got more. Okay. Yes, but... She... She's very brokenhearted. Oh. Um, fresh breakup, I guess. No, that's not it at all. Far from it. It's actually a very sad one. Oh. Her sister died a few days ago. Oh my god. Yeah, her body was dumped along the roadside. Or just been murdered by someone. Oh god. One. Oh my god. That's so sad. I can only imagine what she's going through right now. I know. She's barely keeping it together. <sighs> and she's stated that her mother is totally like losing it. Oh god. Obviously, you know. Poor woman. Who wouldn't lose it? I mean, someone's child was grossly murdered. Mm. Who, who, who would keep it together? I feel so sorry for them. I know. It's, it's actually a very sad situation. Anyway, how could someone murder another human being? It's beyond my comprehension. It is very obvious to me that this case has been cold. It's been two weeks. Two weeks. No progress has been made. No leads at all. <laughs> Officer, what is going on? Make us understand. Are you trying to say that the killers of my sister will go unpunished? No, that's not it. The investigation is still going on. And I want to assure you... Oh, that... please, don't even bother. I have heard this several times and nothing has come out of it. Nothing. Why? Why is justice far-fetched in this part of the world? Why would a young girl die and no one is doing anything to apprehend her killers? <sighs> that is not the case. We are doing everything within the law to make sure that justice prevails. I want to bury my child. I want you to release my child to me so that at least I can give her rest. So she can have peace. The peace that you people cannot give her. Release my child to me. I'm sorry that would be possible at this point. Not until we conclude with the investigation. And besides, the autopsy is not concluded yet. <laughs> hey! Are you hearing this? Did you hear what he said? You cannot find the killers of my child! And you will not give my child to me! So that at least I can do my peace! I want to bury my child! Since you people cannot find her killer or killers, Return her body! I want to bury her myself! I want to bury my child! I am not living here without my child! I will not do it! I want my child! differently. I wish I didn't fail you. <laughs> maybe, maybe if I was a bit strict I would have 
been able to save you from yourself, Sonia. I failed you. I failed you. I failed you. I couldn't protect you like the big sister that I am. I failed you, Sonia. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. <laughs> Losing a child this way is not an experience any mother or any parent should go through. I know. I know. And to top it all off, this country is totally messed up. I mean, one month in and they can't even get a tangible lead, let alone conclude a murder investigation. <laughs> Please. We have lost feet in the peace. I don't blame you. All we want is for them to release the body of my sister so we can bury her and my mom would have a closure. Your mom to have closure? How about you? What about me? Don't you want closure too? I think that you need closure more than your mom. If I must say so. You're going through a lot yourself. Until the killer of my sister goes six feet below. There's no closure for me. I am. You need to take it easy. It's a far away The IPO is calling me. Oh, okay. I'll say it, listen. Hello, sir. Okay, okay. I'll be there shortly. Yes, thank you. Thank you very much that I'll be there shortly. Okay, what is it? I don't know. He, he, he asked me to come to the station. Please, can you? Yeah, let's go. Can you take Quick. me to the station? All right. yes. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, Welcome to my place. I I didn't know you could find me. It wasn't so hard to find. So um, how are you holding up? Just there. What can I offer you? Nothing. I'm fine. I have something in the car. You sure? Sure. Well, I came to spend some time with you because I know how hard things have been for you lately. And you need all the companionship that you know you can get in this world. Thank you. That is so tough full of you. You're welcome. I do appreciate it. That's okay, you're welcome. So um how is the investigation going? 
Nothing yet. No headway, no, no lead. The police hasn't been able to get even a single lead. Ah. This is not fair. I mean, how is one supposed to get closure in a situation like this? I don't know. This is very hard for us, especially my mom. All she wants is just to bury her dead daughter and move on. But they have refused to release her corpse to us. They said it is until after the investigations. That, that's, that's when they will release her body to us. Oh my God. I can only imagine what that woman is going through. Poor woman. I mean, losing a child in such a manner could be a traumatic experience for anyone at all. Hey, hey, baby, come here. Come here, come here. Come on. It's enough. If it's enough, okay? It's enough. It's... Please, you've cried enough. You have cried now. You need to stop this. How can I stop? This is my only sister we're talking about. I know. I know, but it's not your fault she is dead. It is my fault. It is my fault. I wasn't able to protect her. You know, my mom was right. It's not your fault. And you cannot keep blaming yourself forever. She was an adult and she made decisions based on her own actions. But I am her elder sister. I failed. I failed her. I failed my mom. Come on. I failed Come her. On. You did not fail anyone. You didn't fail anyone. Okay, listen. Perhaps we should take a walk outside, you know, fresh air might help. I don't want to go anywhere. I just want to stay here. Uh -uh. <laughs> Look around you, full of memories of her. Staying here will keep reminding you of your sister. So let's just go outside of your house and take a little walk, okay? I don't want to go. Stop this crying. It breaks my heart to see you like this. <laughs> Please, stop it. <laughs> What's up, bro? What's happening? Ever since you've got back, you've been sitting here all Monday. What's happening? Nothing. No, please don't tell me nothing. What happened? You know you can talk to me. I know you two are to be very cheerful, but you're a shadow of yourself. It's Annabelle. That girl, huh? I can't believe this. You're seated here moody. All because of a girl. Dibem, you don't get that. Oh. You're not going to believe this, but that girl strikes a chord in me. Really? Really. And I hate, hate to see her in sorrow. <laughs> oh, wait. Are you being serious right now? Of course. Mayowa, you, in love with one girl? Hell no, this is not happening. <laughs> yes. I am in love with her. <laughs> no, this is not funny. I'm being serious here. Come on, come with it. Listen, I am in love with Annabelle. And this is real. I just can't. It's totally impossible to get her out of my mind. Ha! 
this world is definitely about to end. You, that I know, you are not and cannot. In fact, you don't have the capability of loving anyone. No! You know, you don't need to keep believing in this your notion of knowing who I am. You don't. I love that girl. Oh. I too love her. I mean, my every thought is her. When I'm with her, I am fulfilled. And when I'm not, it's more like a part of me has been yanked off. With the way I'm looking at your eyes, I know the reason you're sounding like this. You've not had her on your bed. The moment you go in and come out, your tone will change. You see, this is why I say you do not know me. I genuinely, genuinely, I'm in love with Annabelle. And come to think of it, I mean, I find her sexually attractive. She's pretty, she's attractive, but I don't even have the urge of sleeping with her, at least just yet. I genuinely love her, and to sleep with her is the last thing on my mind. Wow. She is the one for me, and I need her in my life. Wow, like, I'm amazed. Well, if you're sure of what you feel for her, then you should be happy. I'm happy for you, bro. You shouldn't be moody. I am sure. It's not that I'm a bit moody. It's just that, like I said to you earlier, I don't, I hate it to know that she's going through such, you know, and there's nothing I can do. I know, I know, I know. Let me get you something strong. You need to cheer up. My wife is in love! Damn! <laughs> Unfortunately, I have no good news for you. Though the autopsy has been concluded, your sister died of traumatic head injury. We want her killers apprehended, not what the autopsy says. It's okay. We will continue to look for clues that will lead us to the killers. But for now, we are at a standstill. Do you think anything positive will come out of it? I must tell you, young lady, that from her call log, we did not see any conversation with a stranger on that day. Obviously, she was in communication with a man via Facebook or Instagram. That is where we are facing a big challenge. Because the process of obtaining the transcripts of those conversations is not an easy one. And you know the company is resident in America. But we're doing our best to learn it. So can we now have our remains for burial? Well, it's okay. The body can be released to your family for burial.
They said we can now have her body for the burial. What's up, bro? I'm good. Just on my react. I can see. Um, babe, meet Jivem, my brother, my friend. Oh, hey, Hi. Annabelle, Hi. my babe. Oh, Annabelle, <laughs> she's beautiful. Thank you. You're welcome to our home. Thank you. Uh, he has said so much about you. Really? What? Good things only. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, good things only. Yeah, I'm a good guy. <laughs> like you already know, my name is Dubem. This is where we leave. I'll see you tomorrow because I am way out. I won't be coming back today. The good boy not coming back today. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> okay, be safe. All right. Thank you. Right. So, welcome to my home. Yeah. Finally, you agreed to come. <laughs> <laughs> like it. It's cool. Thank you. Thank you. Can I sit? Of course. Just make yourself comfortable. Thank you. I'm just so happy that you are here. <laughs> you forgive me for being a bit all over the place, okay? <laughs> I'm just so happy that you are here. And I don't know whether to go and get you a drink or to just dance it's or to like... do... I don't want you to walk away. <laughs> I really don't want to walk away. Yes, you sure? I am sure. Excellent. Thank you. You are weak. I know. I just cannot sleep. <laughs> it's one luxury I cannot afford these days. Mommy, please, you, you just have to get used to the fact that Sumia is not coming back ever again. Yeah. It's not that simple. She was my baby and... Mommy, have you forgotten that she was my sister? My only sister. Because I beg you in the name of God. She needs to sleep. Try and rest your head, okay? I 
just can't. The thought of her keeps me awake. Mommy, please try and... Hi, sis. Always serious with your books. <laughs> Sonia, please leave me alone. Where are you going to look in this hot? Like I'm looking hot, right? <laughs> anyway, sis, please, I, I need some money. I need to get a cab. I'm going somewhere. You're going somewhere and you don't have money. You know, like I don't have money, but... Anyway, I know. <laughs> See, I don't have cash. But I can give you my ATM card. We draw 10,000 air. Take 4,000 and bring back my balance for me, 6,000 air. I love you, sis. Thank you so much. It's not about loving me. I'll just bring my money back. I'll bring it. And my ATM card. Mm -hmm. No problem. Thank you so much. But I won't be coming back today. Why? Why are you going to? You've been you? saying, sister, read your book. So I decided to organize a night class with some of my classmates. So we'll be staying over to read. I beg, shut up. <laughs> Hi! Sonia, you, you don't even know how to lie. It does not even fit you. You want to go and read all night reading you that I know. It's all right. Just tell me this is another excuse for sleeping out. Is you want to sleep okay? out. Let me be straight with you. Um, I met this very pretty bobo on Instagram. And I need to have a night out with him, sis. So I won't be coming back. Sonia, what is wrong with you? What exactly is wrong with you? How many times do I have to warn you about this internet nonsense? Must I quarrel with you every oh, day concerning this matter? Please, now I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired hearing the same topic over and over and over again. Are you giving me the money or not? Are you giving me or not? If you're not giving me, tell me. Take, take, just take. Thank you. I'll miss you. Mwah. You don't miss me too much. I'll be back soon. Tell me I'm hot now. That's the way I'll be back and I'll give you this. Love you, sis. What is wrong with this girl? She never listens. Hello? Annabelle, are you there? Hello? Annabelle, are you there? Uh, uh, mom. Baby, what happened? I mean, you you stopped talking. Mommy, I I will call you back. I'll call, I'll call you back. Uh, Annabelle, wait. I I, I want. What is wrong with her? Sonia! Hi! Sonia! Sonia! My God, what Sonia. is... Sonia, please open your eyes, please open your eyes. Hey! What happened to her? Hi! What happened to her? Definitely not right. Something is not right at all. 
she sounded so down and she just ended the call. I need to call her back. The subscriber is currently switched off. Please try after some time. And now her phone is switched off. No. Something is definitely happening. God, please. Please, God. <laughs> Annabelle! Annabelle? going on god please please i can't afford to lose another child i am begging you i am begging you <sighs> so what's what's up with you and this annabelle girl i don't get it right? <laughs> well just because we've been out seen about 20 million women out there and Annabelle is the only one I see even though she is not there she'll tell you something so how so you know what she seemed to be very different from all the other girls and I sincerely hope you stick to this one and stop this foolish lifestyle hey I say I'm a flirt I am not saying you are a flirt everyone knows you are a flirt Listen, I've had an amazing day and I'm not going to go down this path with you. I have my Annabelle now. She's the embodiment of everything that I need in a woman. So I am happy you stay in your lane, okay? You really need to change. I am hungry and tired. Me too! Food for two, please. Ah, oh, what a day it's been. Ah! Dubem! Dubem! Hi, bro. What is it? The dress. Uh, what about the dress? Okay. Wow. Thank you. Nice. Nice. I like. Welcome to my humble home where I manage my life. Mm -hmm. Managing, you said? Mm -hmm. How many of your mates can afford all that you have? What do I have? Nothing. I'm just working so hard to make ends meet. Nothing else. I see. <laughs> Had work in mind. Mm -hmm. So, come. Come show me how hard working you can be. And I'm gonna show you. Come, let's go. Which way, please? That way. Okay. With you. How did this dress get you? I don't know. I just left you. I, I, I came in here and I saw the dress here. What is it doing here? Hold on. Did Annabelle come with another dress? No. No, because in fact, she slept 
in this bed last night in my own t-shirt. This morning we left together, so... Calm down, you, oh, I think you're overreacting. You sure? I am certain of what I'm saying. What do you mean I'm sure? That's quite strange. You know what? You don't need to fret over this. I'll, I'll, I'll get rid of it. <sighs> okay. You see? What is the meaning of this? Yes, sir. Of course, sir. I will give you feedback, sir. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. I'm sorry. That was the commissioner, please. Oh, it's all right. It's all right. I'm also really sorry we have not made any further progress on the case. That is not why I'm here. Officer, my other child is missing. Hmm? How do you mean? I was on the phone with her around 3 a.m. and suddenly she stopped responding for a while. Then she said, Mom, I'll call you back. And she got the call. Since then, her phone has been switched off. That doesn't mean she's missing. I went to her school apartment and she wasn't there either. Her neighbor said she last saw her yesterday afternoon and she hasn't been back since then. That still does not make her a missing person. I mean, she could be with friends somewhere or classmates. No, sir. I am her mother. I can feel it. Something is wrong. <laughs> You saw who? She was standing right behind me. Sonia! I saw Sonia right here! Okay, just calm down. Calm down, you are losing it. How can you say you saw it? I know what I saw! She was right here! Oh my you, just just calm down. Okay, this is this is just your mind playing tricks on you. Take a chill pill. <laughs> This is not real. It's now over 36 hours anyone saw her. My only child is missing and her phone is switched off. Madam, you said you were talking to her over the phone and she said she will call you back and drop the call? Yes. Do you know where she was exactly at the time you were talking to her? I assumed she was in her apartment. Officer. My child. He's missing. She's the only one I have now. And I cannot afford to lose her too. Please. I understand your pain. But you need to calm down. My men are already in the field. They are combing every nook and cranny of this town, and I assure you, 
she'll be found. <laughs> I went to her department. Nobody has seen her today. Not even one person. I don't get it. Madam, please I let need us. to find my child. Please. Just help me find my child. Help me find my child. Madam, <laughs> please, you need to get a hold of yourself. Okay? Let's work together. You guys look like you just saw a ghost. What's happening? Hey, Annabelle, you're welcome to our house. Thank you. Make yourself <laughs> comfortable. How are you doing? I'm good. Nice. Why is your face like this? It's nothing. I mean, I've been trying your line all morning and your phone is switched off. <sighs> so sorry. <clears throat> I am truly sorry. My battery has been down. Okay, I'm truly sorry. I was worried. Mm. <laughs> no need to be worried again, right? I came to cook for you. I am just coming from the market. Ah, that's so thoughtful of you. You know what? We haven't tasted anything nice of in this house. Of course, I know, I know, and that's <laughs> why I'm here to cook for you. So let me just prepare and make you something if you need it. Thank you. I can't wait to have it. I'll be right back. This cannot happen again. This should not happen again. God, because if it happens, I will not survive it. You better not allow it to happen again. It should not happen again. Where is Annabelle? Where is she? God, I'm warning you. <laughs> he better not happen again. You will not like me if it happens again. Trust me. Dubim. Dubim. Get up. Dubim, get up and go to your room. Why sleeping on the bare floor like that when your bedroom is there. Get up. Hey. Come on, get up. Dubim. Hey. Dubim. Dubim. Why are you doing this? Why are you doing this? I asked you a very simple question. And I demand a simple answer. Why? Why? Why did you kill my sister? Why? Shut 
this book, I'm telling you the truth. I'm telling you the truth. I did not kill your sister. Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> do you want to start talking? Oh, do you want exactly what happened to your friend happened to you? Why did you kill my sister? I am asking you for the very last time. Why did you kill my sister? Unless you want me to tell you lies. I'm old up to it, but the truth is, I... I, I swear on my life, I don't know what happened to your sister. I don't know. I was there to console you every single day from when you told me. <laughs> Why would you think I'd ever do that to your sister? <laughs> Where is my car key? Car key. Is this what you're looking for? Hmm? Can I have my car key, please? I'm late for work. You aren't serious. Can I have the money first? Do not make me repeat myself. And I don't want to repeat myself either. The L money. Let me have my car key. The money, please. Listen. Stop it. Give me my car key. I'm not going to give it to you. Give me the money first. Do not make me break your nails. Give me the money that I asked Give me the car key. Come on. Leave it. The money I asked for first. Leave me. I... He's down so hard. Look, look, I'm here waiting for you, okay? Man, this guy is so mean. I'm still here. What? What? You are a pathetic liar. I am telling you the truth. Shut that up. was the last time I saw her. Shut your trap. Shut it up. I'll shut it for you. I don't know what else you want me to say. I don't know. What is this doing here? Who owns this card? My name is written on this card. And I can remember I gave it to my sister the very day she left and never returned. Now tell me, how did this get here? I need you to believe me. This is strange to me. I've never seen this card in my life. You are a bloody liar. I'm telling you. You are a liar! A bloody liar! So, were they able to trace the number? No, not yet. It seems the SIM card was detached from the phone, making it very difficult for us to in the exact location of the form. Ah, no. This cannot be happening again. No, it can't be happening again. God, it should not happen again because I will not survive it. I will not survive it. Please don't let this happen again. What's going on here? Boy! Annabelle. Please. Let my little brother go. He has nothing to do with this. He's, what has he got to do with Sonia? He has nothing to do with... Shut up. Shut up. Shut he... your mouth up. 
So you connived with your brother to kill Sonia? I'm sorry. I didn't mean to kill her. I didn't mean to kill her. I, I, I didn't know what came over me. I didn't mean to kill her. Shut up! What are you talking about? I didn't mean to kill her. <laughs> Don't shut him up. Don't Allow him to talk. <laughs> no, talk! Why did you kill Sonia? Why did you kill her? Hey, Sonia, you're here. Is everything all right? Where's my brother? Am I your brother's keeper? Oh, sorry, I don't mean to upset you. You already did. He's my brother. He's my brother. Oh, You'll come back and meet me in this house. But she's gorgeous. Damn pretty. And I need something like her right now. She wouldn't be a bad idea in bed, you know? You do to her. I, 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 I didn't mean to hurt her. I, I was just trying to. to rip her. And now she's. she's dead. She can't be dead. What do I do? I'm finished. She can't be, she can't be possibly dead. Where's her phone? Her phone should be so old. No one must hear or see this. We need to get rid of her body now. Get rid of her body? Yes. How do I do that? I'm scared. Don't be scared. I am here to help. Then help me do something. So, you killed my sister. And dumped her body by the roadside with the help of this idiot. It was never my intention to hurt her. But you did. It was an accident. What you mean you didn't mean to? This is unbelievable. You did this, Coyote. I didn't know what came over me. What do you mean what came over you? What do you mean I gave you everything? You disappoint me. I didn't know what came over me. I was not thinking straight. I didn't know what I was doing. I swear, I swear I will make you pay! I will make you pay! I will make you suffer! I will pay for doing this to my 
my only sister. I am sorry. I am sorry. I am sorry. God, you're dead. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to kill her. I didn't know what could happen to you. I didn't know what I was doing. I'm straight. Hello, mommy. Mom, please. Call the police and come to number nine in Boku Street. Mommy, this is not time for questions. Just call the police and call immediately. Please, I beg you. I will make you. I am sorry. You will pay for everything that my family has gone through. I'm so disappointed in you.